Hey guys, so if you didn't know, about a month ago, I released part 4 to Sonic 3 Knuckles challenges, and a lot has happened in that past month. About 15,000 views and like 150 subscribers, and I want to say thanks so much for that. This is crazy. So now, it's time for part 5. It's about a monthly series now. And if you haven't noticed, I got an S rank in Gravitation Act 1. Yeah, Death Egg, the one that I struggled for so long last time. And it's actually surprisingly, it's surprisingly simple. simple. You see this? You just take a different path at the start and you wind up here. Extremely close to the end of the level. Magic, you're at the boss. A rank, close enough! Okay, after further research, I know what I must do to beat Ring Grab. I've come up with a strategy. Let's do this. So first we get 30 here. And get another 20 with a free shield and we're safe it skips a little bit of an earlier section and then in return for that we get another 30 rings up here please don't kill me bat but I think we do a little bit of nothing okay there's an electric shield coming up yep here it is yep here's two more and now the only thing we're strapped for is time, which, I mean, this plan was also supposed to get rings while going as fast as possible, which it kind of does. I'm at least getting rings, and I'm going slightly faster, I think, I hope so. I know that there's like 220 rings around here. Here we go. Level maps are your friend. Yeah, we're almost done. And I only have a minute to defeat the boss without a lightning shield. Please stop. Please stop. 30 seconds. How do you beat this guy? Like, actually. Like, when do I hit him? When is it safe? I hate this boss. It's the worst. Like, actually the worst. Well, that was a bust. But I have learned actually how to beat the boss now. So let's try it again. Same strat. Let's go. And we got to go faster. There we go. Finally! That kind of sounds bad. Point is... Come on, Carnival Knight. Just work with me! I was remembering from last time, having about 180 rings around this point means I don't need to go for those extra ring boxes. And I have an extra, like, 20 seconds from last time. Knuckles, just let me go. And I now- Oh wait, I don't have the lightning shield! When did I even lose it? He's gonna drop the ball, and then you can't hit him. You have to hit the top of his head, like, well, where his head is. And then you just don't get sucked in by this thing. And then he's gonna go down. So that took about 30 seconds, so I can do this twice. No way I can only get that. Oh no, I can get more hits on him. I did it! No! Wait! What? I, I did it! Let's go! I thought the timer was gonna keep going! I did it! I beat the Egg Gravitron! I hate that boss so much! Oh, that got a little tense. You know what we've unlocked now? Double team in high voltage! Let's go! I think we have enough time to try out all four racks, or at least three of them. So, double team one. Sonic and Knuckles are teaming up again, but this time they're taking different routes. Press A to switch between Sonic on the top and Knuckles on the bottom, but it costs 50 rings. So if I'm heading back to the left, it's a good time to try the other one. What does this mean? I'm actually really confused. So I don't really know how this works. I know it says you could switch between Sonic and Knuckles, Sonic on the top, Knuckles on the bottom. But what? Okay, that sounds bad. But what does that mean? Okay, I get it. I get it. I go left. So this would probably be a good time to switch because I'm going left, but you know. It is what it is. Whatever. I'm gonna try to hopefully beat one of these new challenges. According to all of you who watched, I only beat Carnival Night, but I did beat Death Egg just five minutes before starting this recording. That's basically in the video. And I also beat it a second time for the video. So come on. If that's not worth a subscribe, I don't know what is. 
Oh, there's no drop dash. Oh, there's no drop dash. I just tried to do it twice. And they're expecting me to get 50 rings from somewhere. This is actually really confusing. And we're screwed. So is the goal just to get rings, I think is what I'm understanding. Yeah, that's a really bad way of getting rings. Speed shoes, that's really helpful. Maybe it would be more helpful if I could actually use them. What the heck just happened? Enough of Double Team 1. Let's see high voltage. Robotnik, Eggman, whatever. He said a devious trap. If Tail's feet touch the floor, he'll be electrocuted. Stay safe by rolling, standing on objects, or flying. So I lose a point every time it's zapped. If you can't avoid touching the ground, try holding down immediately. Oh, this actually seems really fun. Flying battery. Banger tracks. So I need to basically stay rolling, is what it's saying. Or... F I don't know how I didn't lose a point for that one. Oh no, because that's a platform and not like the actual ground. So that means, yep, I can land on that. I think Flying Battery is actually a perfect one, because there's like gimmicks everywhere. That is a gimmick. That is a gimmick. I, I did that intentionally. That's just how you don't call me bad at the game. Yeah, I, I definitely didn't mess up. I did that intentionally, trust. Oh, that's really incompetent. I like using the word incompetent. It's like stupid, but stupid people won't understand it. This one's probably one of my new favorites. Probably behind gravitation, but that one was short. And, oh, I thought I was about to be killed by that thing. Uh-oh. High voltage 2. Sky Sanctuary. Huh. This is not a zone that I would have expected to be in this challenge. Oh, Knuckles is gone. Wait, these are platforms, which means they're not ground. That is ground, though. I mean, it's just the first one from Sonic 1, but I can fly. And, uh, there are platforms, though. Who cares? I care, I guess. Yeah, it's pretty easy. Except when this happens. An intelligent person would not do that. Can I just fly to, like, the next part of the level or something? Like, can I just skip the boss fight? Oh, wait, that actually works. I tried to roll. I don't know why, but I just didn't lose any points there. Oh. No, I was trying to land on this thing. I don't even know why I walked back onto it. Wait, there's a spring down here, right? I don't know what my thought process there was. It's like, where am I gonna land after hitting the spring? Okay, yeah, high voltage shoe, that's easy. But, I mean, I've already looked at everything, so what's double team two? Lava Reef one. This level seems definitely more possible than Carnival Night, because I feel like I know it better. But that I mean I've played a lot more Sonic Mania, which actually has this. Just a few more rings and I can switch to Knuckles. What does this do? So what? I'm confused. Oh, I thought it was a big ring. It's actually normal rings. Uh, I only have a minute. And... Nope. Oh, that hurt. That one hurt. And I think we're done here. So yeah, double team, I don't really like. High voltage, I do really like. Because high voltage makes you really have to think, well, this one is just feels like you're speedrunning. And when it feels like you're speedrunning, I don't like that. That's why Bodyguard and Double Team have been my favorites so far. Because it just makes you actually good at the game, not just like beating the game fast. Sky Sanctuary, because that one I kind of did a little bit of cheating. I don't know if cheating's the right word for it, but cheating's actually the right word for it. That's basically what I did. And also one thing I just learned. If you have the option to take damage or get electrocuted, take damage, because when you're in iframes, you can't get electrocuted and you won't lose any score. Okay, so I clearly did not learn my lesson about the spring from last time, so... Rings! I feel like it's such a genius. Okay, next boss fight. Not, not boss fight, whatever this is. Do I get to do the fast running? No. Oh! That was so easy! C rank! Wow. 
So this is why you don't put Tails in Sky Sanctuary. He just immediately breaks everything. So because high voltage is so fun, I want to do high voltage one. It's actually the best. I don't know how, but that worked. Enemies, right? Yeah, so I can bounce on these. Well, maybe I could if I was good at it. How do I do this? Oh yeah, spin dash. I feel stupid. We're not giving up right now. One more chance. Okay, good. I dodged that mask guy. Uh, oh, that platform saved me. I just really wanted to keep some rings. And I completely forgot what I was doing. And then lost the rings. And got electrocuted. That was really stupid. And forgot to roll. Okay, that's safe. So we can stand here and spin dash. And I forgot to hold down. Well, I am gonna beat this. It won't be today, but in, a, in part six, I will beat this. Trust. But this has been an extremely fun one. I beat gravitation twice. I beat ring grab with a total of an F rank. So we got an S rank, an F rank. I unlocked two new challenges. I gotta play them. And high voltage is now my favorite. I even got a C rank by just cheesing Sky Sanctuary. And I'd say this has probably been the most interesting video of them all out of all of the five I've done. So, you know, if you wanna see part six, I think maybe a subscribe would be nice. Hey, you can do it if you want to, it's your choice. Maybe even joining the Discord, but anyways, I think, yeah, just goodbye.